I'm gonna shoot this mailbox. Why would you do such a thing? Because I want to. Wait. There we go. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> oh, you, that, you know what? Sound does travel slower than light, so that makes sense. <laughs> of course it would happen like that. <laughs> Why like, wouldn't it? It's not like New Vegas is an incredibly glitchy game or anything. Oh, no. You fight like a pansy. At least die like a man. Oh, do you oh, see that, that hurt? Uh, Why don't you go in and bury it, you fucking Whatever pussy? What is happening? Your skull is mine! Ah! There's a corpse that needs to be mopped um, off the floor. Oh, it's you guys! You're over here! What are you murdering? Why are you guys all the way over here? Goodness, he motors fast. You guys are really intent on killing that one jackal. <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> oh, I like it here. It reminds me of my family's motel back home. Maybe we could stay in one of the bungalows. Sleep is pretty great. We'll check out the Repcon test site. Maybe that's where her friend might be. Guy's obviously not here. Oh god, he's back again! Uh, seriously! He never leaves! The ride never ends! The ride never ends! The ride never ends! The ride never ends! I want to get off Mr. Bone's wild ride! Alright, let's see what the hell's going on in this place. Oh god, there's zombies back. I, uh, I can't. Damn it. Feral. Shoot him! She even knows what she's shooting! She's so smart. Wow, she took it out and went- Will Willow! 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 Get him! Oh my god, Willow! Kill it! Or Hope! Somebody, maybe? The baton's not helping, Hope! Hope, give me that baton. Right now. Give it! Give it! Drop it! Drop- Bad Hope! Bad! Sit! The Nikon are amazing when they sneak. Aren't they? Uh, Bad Hope! <laughs> Sit! Sit! Sit. Good hope. <laughs> Do you need something? I'm not seeing anybody here. Are you sure this is where we're supposed to be? I would so love to add a dinky souvenir to my collection. Okay, well, I can get you a dinky souvenir, but that's beyond the point. Well, maybe he's inside. I- ah! <laughs> I'm no threat. I'm not feral. Okay, great. Um, advice for next time. Yell that, then charge at us. Yes. Also, nice hair. I take great care of my appearance. I was a performer in the strip for quite a long time. Before I came here to be with Jason and the followers. Back then, my looks kept me employed and busy. Mm. And... Near the bright lights and interesting people. But I shouldn't go on about that. Sounds like you missed them. I'll just say thank you, as a lady should. I really think it's my best asset. After my smile. Don't you agree? <laughs> <laughs> sure. You see the tall ghoul in a cowboy hat? Yes, he comes by every day. To see me. Well, not me. He's looking for that Jefferson fellow. But I like to think he's looking for me. I have such a crush on him. He's so big and tall and handsome. <laughs> oh my god. Ask him to prom. I'm sure he'll say yes. <laughs> but he isn't here? I told him that Jefferson had gone out into the Mojave as other followers have done before him, but that he had never returned. We assumed he had died. So why does he keep coming back every day? I don't know why he keeps coming back, but I like seeing him, so I haven't tried to make him stop. Well, that seems very selfish of you, honestly. Okay, well, when will he be by today, please? I really don't know. Some days I don't see him until three... Or four in the afternoon. I do know he stays out at that camp by the gate. There's a bed he sleeps there. Hey, why are you still here? Why didn't you go off in the rockets with Jason and the others? I missed the launch. Oh, uh, ah. Uh. I was away in the wasteland. And I don't know really what to do with myself. Now, I'd like to go with him. But I don't know if he'll take me. I haven't the courage to ask him. 
Would you like us to talk to him for you? I can ask him to take you with him when he leaves. Yes, that would be wonderful. Cool. Um, what is your name? I will be sure to ask him when I speak to him. It's Jessica. And thank you for helping me. That has got to be a wig. Yeah, it is. It's definitely, it's definitely a wig, Willow, but don't tell her that we know that it's a wig. Do you think the carpet matches the drapes? It's a wig, Mike, so no. You don't think she's got a wig between her legs? That's called a merkin. <laughs> How do you know that? <laughs> no, seriously, how do you know that? Um, because the name of the president in the movie Dr. Strangelove or How I Learned How to Stop Worrying and Love the Atomic Bomb is named Merkin because he's named after a pubic wig. <laughs> what is the purpose of a pubic wig anyway? I have no idea. I don't know why you would wear one, but apparently... <laughs> oh, <laughs> is it three o'clock already? I didn't think we'd ever find you. Do you still have Chester, my teddy bear? Yeah. Hey. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Willow and I are traveling together, and we've tracked you down to see if you have her teddy bear. Yeah. Will you give it to me? Sure. Excellent. Thank you. Also, you know that girl Jessica, the bright follower? The one that waits to see you every day? Going with the crazy wig hair. Also American, probably. Unconfirmed. Sure. She's madly in love with you and wants to run away with you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you, you now. Okay. Are you going to take her with you when you go? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All well, right. Quest completed. That's well, a good looking dog you have there. I suppose. <laughs> That's weird. Most people are proud of their animals. You do like him, don't you? Sure. Oh, good boy. You're a good-looking fella, aren't you? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. I wish I had a dog biscuit for you. You'd be so happy to receive it. Oh, good dog. He's a good dog. Oh, I promise you go tell what's-her-name that he's going to go with her. <laughs> yeah, pass that message along. Why don't you do right? Like some of the men do. <laughs> Get out of here. Give me some money, too. <laughs> She's singing. Yeah, I like it. Hi there. He says he'll take you with him when he leaves. Great news, huh? Thank you. Here, please take this. It's not much, but it's all I have. I'd like to give it to you as a thank you for what you've done. Oh, good. It's an extra wig. <laughs> you can keep it. You're not going to wear that extra wig? No, Mike. This one's the Merkin. <laughs> oh, God, no! <laughs> What's up? Got your teddy bear for you, and I put the Merkin on it. <laughs> Thank you for helping me. It means the world to me that you took the time to do this. Aw, oh, she's happy. That's a big hug and a kiss. Thank you. Oh, okay. You're welcome. I guess. Did you imagine his personal space issues? I have personal space issues. Please don't hug me without telling me you're going to do that first. You can you can hug him, but you I have I realize to... that's not romantic at all, but you got to let me know beforehand, because otherwise I'm going to go, ah! Ah! and just immediately jump and like run the other direction. I've been mortared too many times. Also, somebody tried to poke me with a stick once. He's only been mortared once, but really, once is too many. No, it was a lot more times than once. No, okay. <laughs> I feel like you should be not carrying a shotgun. The Pancor jackhammer is the best weapon, though. Mm -hmm. So I've heard mm -hmm. from reputable sources. Mm -hmm. Who aren't you? Mm -hmm. What's up? Now that we're friends, are you willing to change your clothes? That's something that friends say to each other. <laughs> What's wrong with what I'm wearing? Nothing. I just want to see you naked. <laughs> <laughs> You'd make an easy kill. That's why you should be wearing proper armor. Oh, okay. I don't care. You can wear whatever you want. You have autonomy over yourself. So why were you alone in that well-furnished tent when we found you? I hadn't been in the Mojave long. I'd arrived at the Mojave outpost a few days before and had already split up with my last travel companion. I tried to find a new companion but couldn't. So I packed up and headed out. 
it was very unlucky that I got into trouble. I've been on the road for almost two years now, and that was about as bad as it's ever gotten for me. Although, I did lose my dog, Big George, on the trip. Hmm. He was killed by geckos. That was my worst day. That's never fun. Thank you. I miss him a lot. And I can see you got revenge by killing those geckos and turning them into a coat. Okay, other questions. What is... I I know it's Hello Kitty, but what the hell... Is it in like an igloo? I don't get it. You must get lonely traveling by yourself. Yes, I do. Even though I'm rarely alone. I had hoped to meet someone special. Maybe someone who would want to come with me on the road. Or maybe someone would like me enough to want me to stay with them. But even though I've met and traveled with a lot of people in the last two years, I have been unlucky in love and friendship. What? Sorry, I got distracted by something over there. You were saying? (laughs) Rude, Mike. Mike wasn't listening, and I'm sure it'll happen someday. I hope so. Okay, other personal question. Ah, you hope so? Ah, what's with all the pencils? You've got ten pencils. I like pencils. You like pencils? I do write in my journal. But have you noticed when you need one, it's never there? Well, if you have ten, or more, there's never a problem. It's always good to have a plan B, or a plan Z. This is stupid. You got a lot of dog biscuits. Why so many? I love them. I made up the recipe for Big George, my dog, but they're so tasty I carry a bunch with me all the time. They're my favorite snack. Okay, well, give me one. Oh, please do. We can always make more. You got some dog biscuits now. All right, let me, let me try this. Hang on. You just gonna eat a dog biscuit on the road here? Of course I am! Was it chalky? Did it have a bad aftertaste? Ah, 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 ah. My mouth is really dry. Okay, drink a new Coca-Cola. Jesus. Careful. They got spies all over. Careful. They got spies all over. <laughs> you want to tell Hope, too? This has been your PSA. What's up? Do you cook for yourself? Or do you just eat dog biscuits? Yes, I really enjoy doing it, too. I can set up a campfire any time. Just ask. I'll want to cook regularly to keep up my supply of food. Do you cook? He claims he makes a tuna fish casserole. It doesn't suck, but that's impossible. That's literally impossible. That's because every time I make it, you won't eat it because it's not chicken fingers or a burger with nothing on it. In that case, can I have your scavenged food? I'll give you a list of ingredients for my favorite recipes and you'll know what I need. Oh, I guess that means I assume you scavenge. You do, don't you? Doesn't everyone? He won't stop looting. And then, if we set up a campfire, I'll be able to cook my food. Sure. Great. Here's a list of ingredients. I'll be happy to share the food I cook with you. Is it like a Hello Kitty turtle? What is that? What am I looking at? (laughs) I want to talk to you about your singing. Oh, you hate it, don't you? I know, I'm a terrible singer. I, I do it to pass the time. It keeps me occupied. It's fun. You do have a pleasant singing voice. I'd like to hear more of it. Sure, I'd love to. Hooray! What have you done? And now we can sing duets as well. There's four of us. We can start a barbershop quartet. How, how's your baritone? Oh! Awesome. You can be baritone. <laughs> I'll be the soprano. I am terrible at singing. I She's shouldn't... terrible at singing. Okay. What the hell just happened? <laughs> what was that? I was trying to start up the barbershop quartet, but no one else joined in. Yeah. All right. New quest time. What's the new quest? Posteria. It's a quest to get the barbershop quartet back together. Boy, we tried that. Didn't work. It's going to be called the Four Merkins. <laughs> I'm also getting an Im- I'm getting a merkin embroidered onto your vest, too. Well, I'm going to get my vest embroidered on your merkin, then. <laughs> I quit. I quit this group. <laughs> you guys don't do what you want. I'm going back to bed. <laughs> What's not to like about a place that has a giant statue to greet people when they come into town? That's a valid point. Oh, sure. She's allowed to comment on Dinky, but Hope's not. Yeah. You hypocrite. You you and Hope stick together. It's, I get this one. Oh. They yeah. keep scratching. Yeah. You can have the one that's got that. She's got the fleas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mangy girl. I don't think Hope can really get fleas because she's all synthetic. This one gets fleas. Yeah. And you love fleas. That's why you picked her. So 
were dinosaurs a pre-war thing or a pre- <laughs> No! She still bleeds a lot of human blood, though! <laughs> I really didn't want to do that, but I had to. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Hope, for submitting yourself for a comedic effect. <laughs> All right, I promise I will not shoot you in the head anymore, Hope. That's a pretty lofty promise that to is, make. I promise I will no longer shoot Hope in the head. I may do it accidentally. You might like, shoot her in other I body like parts. I like how Cass has just been back there the whole time, just like... Plotting? The, the fuck is that <laughs> slut he's talking to? <laughs> I'm sorry! There's too much firepower as it is! It makes the mods too easy! Sorry, I'm just bathing in pussy back here. <laughs> There's only one! Clam fast! <laughs> I don't want to know what Hope's got, but I'm pretty sure it ain't organic. So, there's just nothing down there. There's- I have no idea. I'm, I'm not gonna ask- Hope, take your clothes off. <laughs> <laughs> sure enough. <laughs> well, Mike, she doesn't have anything. Did that answer your question? She was built with parts from a sex bot. How does she not have She any? is shocked right now. She's like, I can't believe you just did that. <laughs> Maybe well, she's maybe she's not shocked. Maybe she's just like, I feel so free right now. <laughs> maybe she wants to run around like this without clothes on. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Jessica's extra wig. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Hide your naked head from the world. Is her armor? Oh yeah, it was a wanderer outfit, and it's fucking broke. <laughs> Sorry, Hope. We didn't realize your your outfit was at zero percent condition, so we can't re-equip it on you. So that, that is distracting. <laughs> Oh. Hey, Willow, Willow, check this out. Watch how cool I am. Woo! Ah! <laughs> Hope and I aren't impressed. We've seen this too many times. But this is a novel concept for you, huh, Willow? Oh my god! Oh god! Ah! Oh, you landed on the ammo crates! Oh my god! <laughs>